Hey guys, welcome back. It's me Rajan Sharma and in this video, I will show you that how can we create a functionality of audio call and video call in the application chat it fine guys. And the best part is that you don't have to write a long part of code. Okay, it will take hardly 10 to 15 minutes and you will be able to integrate this functionality inside this application chat it. Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so this is how our application will look after implementing this feature okay and trust me it is going to be very easy okay and very simple fine guys and guys don't forget to visit rajansharma.com website okay yes because you will get all the course there as well so guys very first of all you have to open google chrome fine and simply search for zigocloud.com and after searching for zigocloud.com you have to simply create an account fine and uh, that process is quite simple that's why I, I just skipped it i mean you guys can create account on zigo cloud fine and after that you have to create a project and uh, when you will create projects you have to select option of voice call and video call and then you have to create the project after that it will ask for uh, sdk or ui kits so you have to proceed with ui kits after that you have to do start and integrate okay then after that your project will be created successfully and after doing all the procedure you will see your dashboard where you can see that your project is created successfully and you will also receive a mail confirming that thing fine guys and after that you will see your dashboard like this fine where you can see that we have this app id and we also have this app sign we will need these two things fine but first of all you have to uh, after creating the app on zucloud.com you have to click on this uh, guide okay so it will show you step by step procedure that what exactly you have to follow in order to integrate that functionality inside our application which is chatted fine so things are going to be super simple you just have to follow the struct uh, you just have to follow the steps that i'm showing you in this tutorial and then things will be quite easy to implement and you will see the magic that you will now you are able to make video call audio call in the application okay and if you want some further features like showing the call history and uh, you know creating a dedicated tab in the application for showing calls so we can proceed with that thing too but in case but now in this tutorial we will only focus on implementing the functionality we will make the base i mean we, we will integrate the foundation of the feature okay so very first of all you can see that we have this guide so first of all you have to add the dependency so guys now you can see that if your android gradle plugin is 7.1.0 or later so you can simply add this fine so guys now we will add the dependency okay so first of all you can see the instruction that if your android cradle plugin is 7.1.0 or later so you can do this but okay but my android studio is not 7.1.0 it's uh, you know older version so what i will do is i will simply open my second level of build cradle and uh, sorry first level of uh, build.cradle and here i will add this uh, simple thing okay now you can see that we will have this uh, okay and i have also added this jit pack so in case if you want so you can remove this uh, jitc maven url because we don't need it now but uh, if i will do it so i have to make a sync now so i will avoid doing that it will take time fine <coughs> so guys you just have to add these two lines because my android studio is older than 7.1.0 if you have latest version so you have to do that thing in here you will see option like settings.gradle here so you have to add that dependency and you can also see that uh, instruction is very clear dependency resolution management you have to give that part you have to give add these lines inside it fine and uh, second thing is again see it is saying showing that if you have earlier than 7.1.0 then you have to do it inside this all project which i am doing here you can see all project inside it okay so things are quite sorry uh, control plus z yeah after that you have to add this dependency so you just have to simply copy it from here and i have added it in the second level of gradle build which is uh, here okay and you don't have to worry about the version because it will work fine if you will not add any okay and uh, then after that you have to you will see that if you want to run the apk chat it or over other apps so you can add this part of code okay but uh, for now we will skip that thing because it's not required it is still showing the notification i mean when you make a call so the other user will receive a notification okay and uh, they are able to pick the call so i think it's not required so i'll just skip it and uh, if you want if you have time so you want to read all that thing so you can go with that okay but we will skip that okay 
so guys now here comes the important part very first of all you have to initialize the call okay so you can see the important values that we have to pass first one is application then app id app sign user id username fine so guys in this initialization part we will pass the user id of ourselves. okay and in the username i will pass my own name fine and this app id and app sign you will get in your console which is uh, here you can see the app id and here you can see the app sign fine and after you just have to copy this code but i will show you the you know better version of this code in integrated part okay so before doing that okay or we can proceed with it no problem i will open message activity and uh, here i will show you let me collapse it collapse all and here we have a method which is initialize call so here you can see that we have this initialize call method part okay not part it's part and you can see that i have uh, given this suid is my own uid and uh, this as name is going to be my name sender name fine and uh, now you know guys after uh, adding these two values and uh, this you have to open the message activity xml part and uh, we will code it inside it yes कैसे मुझे तुम मिल गई किस मत पे आए इस पे कॉपीराइट नहीं आएगा भाई जल्दी खुल जा सो हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू हैव विजिटेड माय वेबसाइट rajeshsharma.com इज इट ओके I mean you are getting the codes are you facing any problem you can provide me feedback on instagram and also on the contact us part i will see the feedback so now you can see that we have this xml part of the message activity so guys now here you can see that uh, here i will implement those two buttons so you have to simply write this code which is zero cloud dot ui kit rebuild call invite widget zero send call invitation button so you have to call this uh, thing okay and you will write exactly the same code that's why i am showing you this you can pause the video write the code or you can simply visit rajansharma.com for source code so guys after adding this part of code what you have to do you have to come back in the message activity and uh, in the very beginning of your activity you have to simply create a variable for zigo send call invitation okay video call audio call then you have to open on create inside on create you have to give the reference that is going to be simple here here you can see the reference this is how we give the reference fine and after doing that what you have to do is uh, you have to here here is our part of code that you need to implement you will simply create a handler handler and inside this handler we will create three methods first one is voice call video call then initialize call here you have to pass the parameter which is as phone it means you have to pass the phone number of sender and here you have to pass the sender's name fine now i will show you the code of voice call inside voice call you have to write only these three lines of code okay audio call dot set video false because it is a voice call so we will not let it do voice call i mean video call and then audio call dot set resources id it should be same you don't have to change anything here okay do not use your own brain just let me use mine fine and uh, you have to write these three lines of code and in the method voice call sorry video call you have to do the same thing but the only difference is here you will make it true because it's a video call so we just want to make it true fine so this is the complete part of code that you have to write inside this application okay you, first of all you have to create chatted project on zigo cloud then you have to select voice call and video call then you have to select ui kits then you have to save and integrate after that you have to um, add the sdk okay then dependency and uh, then after doing that you have to simply create the xml part which is widgets okay and i will provide its code on rajanshama.com as well and uh, after doing all that part you have to give the reference then you have to create these three method which is voice call video call initialize call and after that you have to call these three methods here okay after 1.5 seconds okay and after doing after doing this complete thing when you will run the application so you will see that you will you have the functionality of making video call and audio call okay so boom now chat it have the functionality and you know 
this zero cloud have other features as well that you can use inside your application like in app chat ai avatar virtual avatar so many good features you know it is just filled with and uh, you can see the pricing for now you can see that it is a trial account so i'm not paying any charges for this but in case if you are working for a company or you just want to create a very professional kind of application with video call functionality and you want to make uh, the video call surfing quite uh, you know uh, you can say uh, it will give you a good experience okay then you should go with zero cloud fine and everything is super simple easy to integrate and uh, you can pay as you use the services every month 10000 uh, minutes are free as you can see yes guys 10000 minutes are free so you can use that uh thing for for growing your business for growing your application so this is the complete uh, you know overview that i wanted to show you in this tutorial and uh, i hope you guys like this video so please like share and subscribe my channel and do not forget to press the bell icon so you will never miss any update thank you for watching and if you want source code simply visit rajansharma.com do not join membership on youtube channel okay listen very carefully do not join membership on my youtube channel you have to visit rajansharma.com you can pay with upi you can pay with credit card you can pay with paypal any mode of payment is available on my website so simply visit rajansharma.com and get all the codes thank you for watching